With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Question is, a small bar magnet A oscillates in a horizontal plane with a time period T at a place where the angle of dip is 60 degree. When the same needle is meant to oscillate in a vertical plane coinciding with the magnetic meridian, its time period will be. Hence, we can say here when it is vibrating in horizontal plane, the time period T is given as 2 pi square root of. We have here as I divided by we can say m into bh where bh is the horizontal component of earth's magnetic field and here in the case of in the plane which is in a vertical plane coinciding with magnetic meridian so we can say here this comes out here as t dash equal to 2 pi square root of i divided by m into b hence dividing these two we get here as t divided by t dash we have here as square root of this becomes our b divided by we can see as bh now here bh can be written as let's say b cos of delta where delta is the angle of dip given in the question as 60 degree hence b and b cancels out so we have here as t dash is equal to t into root under cos of this is delta now substituting the value we can say this comes as t under root cos of Delta is 60, so cos 60 is 1 by 2, hence the new time period comes as T by root under 2. Hence we can say here option number 1 is the correct answer. That is we can say here when the same needle is meant to oscillate in a vertical plane coinciding with the magnetic meridian, then its time period will be T by root 2. That is 1 is the correct answer. So 1 is our answer. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.